Hello my beautiful friends and welcome back to my channel. Thank you for clicking on today's video. Today I'm sharing with you my Bath and Body Works haul for the semi-annual sale for 2022 or summer 2022. We got a bunch of goodies. Let me show you what I got right here. It's pretty heavy. Are you ready for this? <laughs> ah, that's a lot of stuff. I did go four times. Not a lot of a lot of people. <laughs> but I just kept going and kept going and they would send out a coupon and I would go again. Today, this morning was my last time going to pick up some, a scent that I really wanted, but in the beginning it wasn't on sale. It was on sale for half and then it was on sale for 75% off today. So I waited a little bit for that. But if you're new here, hi, hello, my name is Erica Ashley. I always upload three videos every single week all about project planning, makeup hauls, fashion hauls, shopping hauls, shoe hauls, vlogging, all the fun stuff, and makeup and beauty. And if you love that content, then I'd love you to hit that thumbs up, subscribe before you go, and, and turn on those notification bells to be aware on my future uploads. Normally, I am a makeup channel. I have a full face on. But today, this is what I look like about 95% of the time. No makeup, tank top because it is hot in here. And I did cut my hair, so it, I can recently put it on a ponytail this week. So I'm excited about that. <laughs> Um, but there is no need to feel like you have to wear makeup. I enjoy it. It is a passion of mine and I absolutely love it. But I never feel like you have to wear makeup. You shouldn't feel that way. So I was like, you know what? This is what I look like in daily life. This is how I look shopping for all these things. And <laughs> I'm just going to record it like that. So if you want to see my Bath and Body Works haul for the semi-annual sale this year, then go ahead and keep on watching. Alrighty, my beautiful friends, I am not afraid to come on here with a bare face. This is how I am. I did some riding around, took a shower, um, well, I did some riding around, cleaned, ate lunch, took a shower. I was relaxing. I was like, I need to get this film, but I want to put on makeup. I was like, you know what? I don't have to put on makeup. I don't have to. I just popped on some gloss. So the first time, I think all the times I went with my husband and my stepson, except for this, pre this last time, no, twice. Twice I went them and then twice I went by myself. So let's go ahead and see what I got for the first stop. Alrighty, bag one. This for my little receipt. I went on 6-11. So, oh wow, almost a month. I guess this semi annual sale is a month long. Today is today is July 5th, and the lady did say it'll be lasting for another week. So hopefully I can have this up before the sale ends. There's also, you can shop online, there's plenty of coupons, and I've used, I think, two coupons. So I do have a large collection, I will pop in a picture of right here. I want to film a Bath & Body Works candle collection, and also a Bath & Body Works collection of my sprays and body sprays, and a few uh, shower gels. So I was looking on my collection and counting sprays versus lotions. I actually have more lotions than I thought, so I was like, let me get some more sprays. So I bought six sprays one cent the dark kiss I wanted it wasn't at it was at one store but we went to another store and I haven't gotten it so hopefully I can get it soon that's the only one on my list and then the firecracker pop and then another one that I did get a lotion of so there's about three cents that I do once that I couldn't find but it's okay I just didn't want to place an online order so I, like I said I got six there's three more right here the first one I got is my favorite scent of all time. It is Champagne Toast. This is a newer packaging. It is so beautiful, so pretty. It's my absolute favorite candle, my absolute favorite scent, and now they have blends. Smells so wonderful. The notes are, I'll put them on the screen, bubbly champagne, sparkling berries, and juicy tangerine. Tangerine, orange, and mandarin are my absolute favorite notes. If you pay attention to the notes, you will see that all of them have orange and mandarin or tangerine in them. That is just one of my favorite scents overall. I love oranges. I love citrus. But orange, blood orange, anything orange, I absolutely love. And when I was paying attention to the notes this year instead of just the smells like I normally do, I was like, all of these have orange in them. But I do not care. So the first one was Champagne Toast. And I wanted to film this because I wanted to, I want to start using these. So I was like, let me, let me showcase what I bought and start using these guys. And my goal is to get more summer scents. I don't have a lot of summer scents. I have a lot of fall and springy, but no summer. So I wanted to capture the summer this year. 
So I picked up Copper Coconut Sands. This smells, oh, it smells, smells like, I smell the coconut. It smells like, Baby Physicians Formula Coconut Bronzer. That, so I love that. The notes are sun-kissed coconut, soft orchid petals, and creamy sandalwood. So I do love sandalwood as well. I love amber. Mm, smells good. New packaging, the cute little leaves. So I am ready to get my summer vibes on. I do not like summer. I like the way summer smells. Summer here has been 100 degrees. I'm not liking summer. I'm becoming a vampire. Um, my face is pale. My arms are, my, my chest are dark. I try to SPF as much as I can. Next, I got Bahamas Passion Fruit and Banana Flower. I do not have this one. The notes are passion fruit, pineapple leaves, and banana flower. Mmm. I can smell, I can smell all the fruity goodness. Mmm. Smells beautiful. Very, very summer appropriate. And then Sunset Glow. Look at this beautiful packaging. The notes are fresh coconut, sparkling cherry seltzer, dreamy moonflower, and caramelized vanilla. And I've been wanting to layer all of my stuff. Instead of, I used to only use like this one with the matching body lotion strictly. Now I want to, that was for years. Like I was like, okay, I have to use the same lotion as a spray and now I'm like into the whole mixing world so I think that's why I got more sprays can't smell this one just, I don't want to spray it because I just took a bath I don't want to be spraying like a whole bunch of bath and body works next I got well the cap is loose Sun, sunshine mimosa it is bright bubbly champagne and fresh citrus so I love a good mimosa can't really smell this one either I guess no one had sprayed it but my cap is loose so and I love the orange packaging this one I was not on my list but it smells so good it is jasmine extract uh, tuberose oil white gardenia pink pepper I do like a lot of pink pepper I have a hair on me pink pepper and cashmere musk Oh, I can smell the musk, but not in a bad way. Mmm, so delicious. Mmm, so pretty. So that one I spent $46.76. What did I buy? I think my stepson bought some stuff because I see graphite, strawberry, pound cake, and I didn't get any of that stuff. I think he got a candle. Yeah, he got a candle. Oh, yeah, he got a candle, and he got, um... I forgot what else he got. Oh, he got a candle, a sanitizer, and then the hand soap, and I'm not too sure what else, because I was like, that's a lot for what I paid. But all the ones I bought were $4.95. So one, two, three. Yeah, all of them were $4.95, and then he bought something at $3.75, $11.95, and then $13.50. Um, what was the graphite? I don't know what the graphite was, but that was for him. So that was my first trip my next trip I was what was I doing I was running around I was like oh let me just go in for something and I called my aunt I was like hey do you want anything from the Bath and Body Works sell she's like just she's like give me the car sense I had no idea they had car sense so I bought my husband I put one in my car one of my stepson's car and then I bought this for my husband but my stepson loved it so much, he bought one for his girlfriend, and then he thought I didn't buy one for my husband because he was using the work truck and not his car, so he's like, I want one in the work truck. So he bought one, so I have an extra black one. Our Two of our cars are black, one is gray, so I just bought the black and then the gray one. I bought one spray. I bought her, she wanted the tiki wood, or the mahogany tiki wood, so she, she got those. And then I bought, I put watermelon lemonade in my car, then I got strawberry pound cake that is my favorite I bought the mahogany teak wood for them another strawberry pound cake water watermelon lemonade and then a mahogany tiki wood I must have put the mahogany tiki wood one two no I bought have six for my household and I put one in their car I thought I put two I don't know I'm confusing myself so try to remember that's why I wanted to get this and I can just do everything and then do the haul I don't know why I'm like that. I have to have everything like 
I don't know. <laughs> but I love these. If you haven't tried them, they said it lasts a month. Mine lasted about three weeks. But I think because it's so hot here in Texas, it's just going away a little bit faster. So I did date. I did keep track of the when I put my newest one in, which was just yesterday, July 4th. So hopefully it'll last until August 4th. But I don't know because it's summertime. And then she said you can just bring it back. And then I only got one spray, which is pretty as a peach. I love peaches. Blushing peach, jasmine petals, white nectarine, um, apple blossom, and sheer freesia. Freesia? Freesia? It smells like classic peaches, but in the best way, not in a strong way. Not in a, like a super fake way. Oh, not like a, not, not like a two-faced peach, but just, just different, like a fresh peach. I love peaches. Peaches, I love peach tea, peach, a lot of peach thing. I love fresh peaches. I love peach wine. Give me all the peaches. So I just bought one from there. I think I made five trips. <laughs> and then I went back by myself again. That haul was on a 614. Oh, and 613. <laughs> I did it before. I bought... Some more car champagne toast and then the pound cake. So what did I put into his car? I must have put watermelon lemonade in both of our cars. So that'll be that. That's goodies. I bought one shower gel, two lotions, and then four sprays on this haul. So I bought a pink watermelon um, body cream. I didn't want any more body creams, but I couldn't resist this one. Juicy watermelon, pink petals, and dewy aloe. Oh, watermelon just reminds me of the summertime. Oh, it smells fucking delicious. I want to slather this all over my body right now. Oh, I, do they have pink watermelon? Um, The body spray? I did not see it. I only saw the lotion, so that's why I grabbed it. And then to match that one, I got a champagne toast. Um body spray bubbly champagne sparkling sparkling berries and juicy tangerine i love this is like my absolute favorite oh it's i love it and then i bought a champagne toast shower gel for when i take a bubble bath and then these next are one is a fall one and then the rest are summertime i bought salt water breeze please don't tell me i bought two of these i'm gonna kill myself not really but oh that smells so good so the notes are fresh lemon, violet leaves, water blossom, and white musk. So I do love the musky scents. If I bought two, then I'll just, I don't know, maybe put it into a project or something like that. And then I bought Fiji, Shun, Fiji Sunshine Guava Teeny. So cute. Sunkissed Guava Fresh Orange and Seaside Jasmine Orange is my favorite note. I... Can't really smell off the nozzle but it's okay i smelled it in store all these i smelled in store that's kind of why i didn't want to there's one i think i haven't popped the picture but i when i smelled the the note sounded amazing but when i was smelling it in store it smelled like leaves like just leaves so like i don't want that then i got seashore island it smells very fresh and breezy like kind of like a clean linen. The notes are clean cotton, okay, orange blossom, orange, blue freesia, and ocean musk. I do love the musk. So, blossom, orange, and musk are the the common notes that I've been drawn to. But this is very beautiful scent. And then winterberry wonder. I have a, some a lotion of this, and I absolutely love it. It is uh, ruby frost, winterberry, sparkling cranberry, and crystal vanilla very this will be for like i think winter time well winter berry but that's why i'm gonna use it during the winter but the packaging is let me give you let me see if i could grab my other one see it and it's not like i need not like i need anything but it's okay i do not definitely do not need anymore but uh I think this is the, no, that's cherryberry. I know there's winterberry. I mean, what did I say? Hmm. 
Do I have a winter berry? I'll have to figure it out. All right, I couldn't find what I was looking for, but if I do, I'll take a picture and pop it up right here. So on this, the one with the little studs, the, the caps are loose. So that was my second trip with the third one that I showed you. And then 4th of July, and then 4th of July, me and my husband and my stepson went again. <laughs> this time I bought soaps and body sprays and some car fresheners. Only three body sprays. And then we bought the uh, the Blackberry Merlot. I did put this one on my Jeep yesterday, and my husband loves this one as well. Champagne Toast, our favorite. I think those are the only two. Oh, my stepson wanted the Mahogany Coconut like this one, so he likes that scent. And then we bought two of these Sunshine and Lemons Foaming Hand Wash. The notes are yuzu, grapefruit, and sunray. So we did buy two of them, but we did smell them. The, the hand soap collection wasn't, you know, great. Of course, I didn't look, but these were like 188, I believe. 149. So I was like, I can't pass that up. So we did buy those, and then we bought the same one, three watermelon or coastal watermelon beautiful this was juicy watermelon pinch of pink sea salt and ocean waves so since we bought three i'll probably use this one for our kitchen that's where we're at majority of the time you know so a little bit is leaking but that's okay and oh it smells it just smells amazing oh so happy i love that the body works as you can tell Next, I did use this one yesterday. It is the watermelon lemonade. So I think if I pair this with the pink lemonade and then the watermelon lemonade, I think I'll just smell like juicy watermelon and somebody will probably freaking bite me. So it's watermelon on ice, sparkling water, and sugared lemon. Oh my gosh. If this doesn't smell like summer, I don't know what does. Oh, like fresh summer breeze with a, like if you're blowing through a fruit cart. Mm, it smells delicious. And then... The, these I wanted, but they were $8.50 when I originally went, and so I wasn't going to pay that. I only wanted to pay 3 to $4, so I waited, and these are $4.95 now, or 4 something. Then I got strawberry soda. This was fresh strawberries, bubbling seltzer, and crushed ice. Good strawberry scent. I figure I can layer maybe my peach and then strawberry. I'm going to figure out my layering techniques. If you have any layering suggestions, please let me know. There is a girl that I do watch. Her name is Jasmine. I will leave her link down below and pop her in right here. She is amazing at layering scents. And then I bought fresh coconut colada. It is coconut milk, vanilla rum, and pink hibiscus. I do like that scent, that note. Oh, it just smells like a fresh shore coconut beach. Like a coconut, like a breeze from the ocean it smells beautiful i love it so that is everything on yesterday's haul the fourth one <laughs> and then today it was my last time that i went i used my last coupon but because i was looking for this scent the oat um the orange vanilla twist orange is my favorite and i i wanted this one but i was only it was 850 and then today it was like four something so I did pick up two of these. The notes are juicy orange, summer sherbet. I love me some sherbet, especially orange sherbet with vanilla ice cream. It makes like a creamsicle. Creamsicle is my favorite. And then vanilla cream. So I bought, I had to buy a backup. I, I don't like backup of sprays, but it is my favorite and I feel like it's all year long. So I did buy two. And then I said, no more lotions. And I bought two lotions. <laughs> I was hoping to find the shower gel, but I did not. But I did buy two of these. This is the bubble gum pop. I did want this scent. It is very sweet though. It is gumball sugar, candied fruits, and citrus burst. It is very sweet. So I was like, I didn't want to pay $8.50, but I would pay $4.50 for it. But I bought it in the shower gel. And maybe I should have bought the lotion too, but I need to calm my calm my roll. I need to slow my tits down. I need to calm my tits down, really. 
So this one smells delicious. And look, it's so cute, super cute. So I love to take bubble baths. Bubble baths are very relaxing for me, especially with my anxiety kicks in or stuff like that. And then just to calm down and just to collect myself, I'll just pour a glass of wine, beer, bubble bath, and YouTube or a book, and I am perfectly happy. It is my happy place. I bought one more. It is <laughs> one more hand soap. It is an island margarita. It is fresh squeezed lime and sea salt. You know, margarita's perfect for summertime. And then this is the vanilla lotion that I want to mix everything with. It is vanilla coconut sparkler. The notes are creamy cake frosting, vanilla sprinkles, um, rainbow sprinkles, and vanilla bean. So this one just smelled too good to pass up. These are the last two. I know they were testers, but they weren't, but I do get that really strong vanilla bean. So maybe I can, you know, mix these two together, the vanilla note and vanilla note. So I'm going to really pay attention to the notes to figure out how to pair them. So that is going to be my goal soon. And then, like I told you, I think I bought this one. I, I bought two of them. It's okay. Um, fresh linen, violet leaves, water blossom, and white muscle. Since I have two, I'll go ahead and open one of them and I'll start to use that right now. But I just like it in the store. I spray it on the card. I walk around. I look. And then I don't like to spray it. Sometimes I'll spray it on my body, but then you figure out. You can't remember which one you like. So I just spray it on the card. Walk around. Let it set. Sometimes if I'm only going in for one or two, I'll spray one on one side, one on the other side. Let my body chemistry work. And then I'll go back at a later date. Because sometimes I'm like, oh, this smells good. And then I get home, I'm like oh that fucking stinks so I'm like why did I buy that <laughs> and then sometimes I'm like oh I don't like that and then I get home I'm like oh that smells good I wish I would have bought it so they, your body chemistry changes it just works differently you know so that's why I always like to wait or like in the mall shopping for a perfume I'll spray it and they're like oh what do you want to buy it I'm like let me walk around leave me alone let me walk around see how I feel after about 10 15 20 minutes and then if I like it with my body chemistry, I'll go ahead and purchase it. Sometimes they're, they're I don't know, salespeople. And then I bought one candle. I bought the Market Peach and Strawberry Pound Cake. Strawberry Pound Cake, I probably have a lot of. Right now, I think that's my most candle. If not, then it's the Strawberry Pound Cake and the Champagne Toast. But I have uh, the Strawberry Pound Cake in my kitchen right now. But this one smells so good. I think I'm gonna start burning candles here. There's my plants. I just bought these plants, so I like to show them some love, show them some attention. Um, the one, this is June and this is Penny, <laughs> but I'm creating a plant vlog. So this is the only candle that I bought. I do have a large candle collection. I thought I had a larger candle collection, but <laughs> The kids love candles, so they come they come in my stash and get some candles, which is okay. I do buy some, them some candles from time to time. Um, and I think at the old house, they got more into more of my candles. And then when we moved, I don't think they figured out where I put my candles. I don't even know where I put my candles when we moved. I had to find them. <laughs> but only one candle. So that's good. I'm going to do um, a collection video next. Those are the next videos you see within July. So yeah, that is everything that I purchased from the semi-annual sale at Bath & Body Works. Yes, I do have a lot. I do want to go through it. I do love body sprays and lotions. And now I'm into layering. So I'm definitely going to get more use out of my lotions. I know this is probably a bit excessive. But this is my life. This is, <laughs> this is <laughs> real shit. So, I can be spending my money other places, I could be pissing it down the drain, I could be at the bars every day, but I'm not. I choose to spend it in makeup and Bath & Body Works. I ha actually have not shopped a Bath & Body Works sale in quite some time, and it's been years. Literally, probably three to four years since I purchased something. So, I did go a little bit crazy because I, I hadn't purchased so long, I just have a lot, and then since I moved everything is you know before it was kind of like a little bit here a little bit there and then I started to get organized and then we moved so I did organize all of my lotions and body sprays I have a few downstairs but majority I moved upstairs to my beauty room and then just the ones that I'm going to use you know or, or that are in projects they are downstairs so I definitely will be 
figuring out what scents I want to wear. I like to wear different scents. Um, I can wear the same one to work all the time, but if we're going out and about, I love to switch everything up. I do have a large perfume collection as well. I just love scents. I love to smell good. Um, I love, <laughs> I love Bath and Body Works. I mean, who doesn't? I love candles. I love it all. Leave me alone. <laughs> let me be. Let me be happy. It's, I'm not bothering anybody. I am going to use my stuff up. It is not going to waste. Sometimes, like, you know, I give stuff away. Um, it's not, it's collecting dust, but I check, I check them all once I moved, and they all smell perfectly okay, and the consistency in the moisturizers, they're perfectly okay. One was kind of watery. I took it downstairs. It was a tiki mango. I shook it, and then it was perfectly okay. So that's the, that's the one that I've been using mostly lately, is a tiki mango. But now the, the texture is perfectly okay. It just needs like a good shaking. So some are probably older, but I, like I said, when I put them up here, I smell them and I check them and they are perfectly okay. They, uh, I don't know if they expire, but I know you can check the dates and all that stuff. But enough into that, you will see that in my collection. But thank you guys for watching and for not judging me in my crazy obsessed Bath and Body Works haul and collection coming soon. My dog is barking. I don't know what I, But thank you guys for joining me in this video and not judging me. I love you all so, so much. And please let me know down below what you picked up from the Bath and Body Works semi-annual sale. What are you interested in? What were you thinking of picking up? I know they will be having a Christmas one. I may not. I may get some fall ones or Christmas ones or maybe just candles. See how I do with this. See what I use up and stuff like that. So I'm super excited and I'm super excited to be layering everything right now. But thank you all very, very much. I love you all and I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful day. And I'd love to hear about what you picked up. So let me know. And I love you guys. See you in my next one. Bye.